we want to solve the following one-step linear equations. And we've already done this using whole numbers, but now we're going to be using integers. So looking at these two examples, notice how the variable is on the right side, which sometimes can be a little bit strange, but it really doesn't matter which side of the equation we isolate the variable on. So for these, we'll isolate the variable on the right side. So for negative 7 equals x minus 14, we want to manipulate the equation so it's in the form of some number equals x. So looking at the right side of the equation now, we don't want this minus 14 with the x. So we'll perform the opposite operation on both sides of the equation to undo the minus 14. Well, the opposite of minus 14 would be plus 14. So we'll add 14 to both sides of the equation. Notice on the right side of the equation, minus 14 plus 14 simplifies to zero. So we're left with x on the right side. And then on the left side, we have negative seven plus 14. Well, negative seven plus 14 would be positive seven. So our solution is seven equals x, but this is often written in the opposite direction as x equals seven. Looking at the second example, we have 23 equals x plus five. And again, our goal is to isolate the variable on the right side of the equation in the form of some number equals x. So we want to undo this plus five on the right side because it's on the same side of the equation as the variable. Well, the opposite of plus five would be minus five. So we can subtract five on the right as long as we subtract five on the left. Plus five minus five is zero, so we're left with x on the right. And then on the left, we have 23 minus five, which is equal to 18. So the solution is 18 equals x, but this is normally reversed and written as x equals 18.